All right, Dana. High hopes for the Aggies this year. Definitely. The Utah State football team is coming off its first ever Mountain West Conference Championship. And with 12 starters back, the Aggies are looking to repeat this season at Mountain West Media Day in Las Vegas today. That championship had a certain ring to it. Break out the jewelry. The Aggies are the defending champs. This is the first time I've worn it since I got it, actually. So we don't try to wear it too much, but for stuff like this, you got to let people know. Logan Bonner liked what he felt last season holding that Mountain West Championship trophy, and he wants to do it again. It felt real as soon as I got on stage uh, after the game. I think that uh, it was five and a half, six years of waiting for me. Um, a lot of emotion was coming out. Coming back into the locker room and you just see the smiles and the smirks on the coaches' faces, the players' faces. Like we just look at each other, like, "Wow, we really did that!" You know, we're just so proud of ourselves, and it, it was a true—I mean, it was truly a, a great experience. But after such an incredible season, the Aggies aren't going to sneak up on anybody this year. Every year is a different year. Um, we know last year has nothing to do with this year's team. Um, we have new guys, new replacements some of the new coaches, um, so I think that the whole goal is just to restart. One thing that we've done a good job at is putting that, putting last year to the side because this is a new team, it's a new season, anything can happen, so you just got to stay humble. After setting five single season school records last year, including most yards passing and most touchdown passes, Bonner has made several national quarterback watch lists. You want to say you don't look at it and you don't see it, but like, yeah, we see it this day and age, like, yeah, you see it, you're tagged in it, you see it, you see, you look on who else is on it, but at the end of the day, like, those only come if you win. Utah State won 11 games last year, and yet the Aggies were picked to finish third in their division, and no Aggie made the preseason all-conference first team. We like, like it like that, yeah. We have this underdog mentality, and we're not surprised um, about any of the preseason rankings. We just like to uh, just go out there and do our best, and however people think is how they think.